Hold on, what does he say? Hi, this is Bruno and Faye. So if you guys are new to our channel, figure skating is something that we started three or three and a half months ago, more or less. So make sure you guys subscribe, stick around and enjoy our videos. We're now moving on with our ice dance journey. We have learned one dance already. It's called Dutch Waltz. We did some videos previously on that one that you can check out on our channel earlier. While we're still working on our Dutch Waltz, it's very far from perfect. <laughs> We decided to expand a little bit and explore the canasta tango, which is the second beginner dance in ice dancing. And basically that's what we've been doing most of this week. If you're not very familiar with ice dancing, the way it works is you usually get like a paper, looks kind of like this, that outlines all the steps and this is how you learn it, with a paper and Ideally with a coach, but we're not looking for easy solutions, I guess. <laughs> so we just uploaded the paper on our phones and tried to learn it by ourselves. On the first day, we just tried to figure out how the steps go. So we were skating around with a phone just trying to memorize <laughs> trying to memorize the steps and trying to figure out where everything goes where all the elements go uh, it added a new element that we haven't really tried before together the chasse so we kind of faked it to the best of our ability The biggest challenge between the Dutch walls and the Canasta Tango is the space because in the beginning we didn't really notice that the space changed so we actually practiced all the way around the ring. So if you compare the two dances side by side on the paper you can see that the Tango is a little bit more shorter. confined, yeah. yeah it's a little shorter, it doesn't take up the entire length of the ring which took us a while to realize so we put a lot of effort into making our lives way more difficult than they needed to be. Cross roll. Swing roll, yeah. Cross the swing roll. Beginning. Once we figured out where everything goes, we started practicing the elements separately just to make sure that we're doing them in the right way and that they feel nice and comfortable. So if you're an experienced ice dancer watching this video, by now you probably have already noticed what's wrong with this picture. If you're a beginner like us, find out in a second. There's a big plot twist. <laughs> Why does he say reverse killing? So yeah, um, we've been working for a week on the Canasta Tango and we have just discovered that this whole time we've been doing the wrong hold. So <laughs> We're starting over. We scratch that, scratch that first part of the video and the entire week in our life and we're starting over. We didn't even know the reverse killing was a thing 
until yeah. we were looking at the counts and somehow I happened to read that it says rivers kill him so the things we learn <laughs> yeah. of skating the second you switch places nothing works anymore end of our problems however we have additionally discovered that we've been doing chassis wrong the whole time because the scheme the paper is not really specific it just says chassis and which foot it's on so that's kind of all you get so like I said we faked it to the best of our ability and our ability proved to not be ideal <laughs> so now we're trying to relearn to do the chasse with the correct leg like, position. What happened was that we were doing three chasses lifting the knee instead of just the first one and the other two extending the leg. <laughs> Apparently, there are different types of chasses. You live and you learn. If you guys know what this dance actually is supposed to look like, please, please, please leave a comment down below. Let us know what we need to work on because this is super confusing we're trying our best to figure it out but you know it's a work in progress and we would appreciate any kind of help So this was our final result after one week of practice. Let's see where we can get, if we can get it better. And see you guys next week. <laughs>